This MIT engineer is working on a radical new technology that could revolutionize access to abundant clean energy. But her biggest hurdle wasn't an engineering challenge. It was a cultural one. I think one of the hardest things about doing a startup in this area is you can't just have a cool technology. It has to be appealing for people. It has to be something that people actually want in their communities. This is Stand Together Presents. Stories, ideas, and advice from changemakers tackling our biggest challenges. Oh shoot, is that my, that was my entry, huh? My name is Caroline Cochran and I'm the co-founder and COO of Oglo Inc. We're working in advanced nuclear power plants, but in a totally different way. Historically, big utilities would build big power plants and plunk it down in an area that then would usually protest. Instead, what we're looking at is a small powerhouse that's community scale. The community has to want it. So how do you do that exactly? <laughs> oh gosh. We really started with what do people need now and talking to customers? And what steps can we take to get towards that? I think engineers tend to think, oh, I've got this cool technology, people should want it. But you need a relentless focus on making a product that people actually want. What we're trying to do is invert that paradigm so people want us to be part of their community. There's this human element that really can't be replaced. Policy, art, culture, they're what move humankind. Being part of that culture of the day can really change how you view the technology you're working on. In a sense, it feels like it's, it's actually kind of a hack. We've always had this desire to actually meet customer needs. And that's what I get back to is like, start engaging with them and getting to know them. When you do that, you start to see the potential upsides and the sky's the limit for customers.